are you sure you want to short AMC stock right now? I want to see Motley Fool asking this question, Ken Griffin, and I want to see his reply though. This is priceless. Anyway, guys, why why AMC is running like crazy today? It's not because of the settlement period for the call options expired in the money last week. This is supposed to happen on Thursday because settlement period usually is on Wednesday. Today is just Monday, guys. I know the hype is big, but we have to stick to the numbers. Also, I think the options expired in the money contracts were around 40,000. So the price action won't be uh, amazing, right? It will definitely help and boost the price action on the day after they have the settlement period for buying back the options. But today things are looking very, very good, guys. Already 5.3% gains for the day. We lost some gains. We were way above 43 dollars. Now we're 4280, 4290s. Very, very good. I would say even just think about it. For one hour, we jumped from 6 million volume all the way up to 25 million. Uh, you understand how fast uh, people are changing the sentiment when they see the gains, when they see that there is a lot of traction on the stock. Like I said, usually, in my opinion, people are more active when the stock is in green, when the stock is in upward direction. People are actually prefer to buy uh, on the higher levels rather than buying the dip. Uh, I know there are some people who kept buying the dip, who enjoy buying the dip, but the majority of the people, I'm judging just by the volume levels, right? When the stock is, is break even, trying to break even, trying to turn from red uh, into green, there are not so many people trading, people are waiting, people want to see the clear direction, the clear path. Are we going to see reversal or we're just going to stick to the consolidation level? But at the days like the day, just look at the chart. We just broke higher highs, higher lows, higher highs, higher lows uh, until we hit the 43.25. Then we start making lower lows and lower highs. But uh, I believe finding consolidation at these levels of 43 is very, very good, very healthy. This will help us to build leg up to the levels of 44, 45. And after that will be very, very tricky. Simply because we know the options at the strike price of 45 bucks are ticking away. But again, not everything is perfect. This particular price action on Monday is a double edged sword because, in my opinion, a lot of people will be again so hyped about the options, right? Because even the closer we get to the 45 dollars price, this means that more and more people are tend to buy options, which is not necessarily bad, just this is my opinion on the situation. I don't want people uh, to lose money as we saw during the last weeks. Also, looking forward, this means that the short interest potentially will go down. It's down for now 15% from the from the previous highs. Uh, the higher it gets, the lower the short interest will go, in my opinion, because it will be much harder and expensive for new short sellers to enter or even double their previous position. So like I said, this particular price action on Monday, it's a double edge sword. It couldn't bring only the positives to the stock, right? It will decrease the short interest. It will make some people potentially to buy some options. Just think about if we're able to, to find this consolidation at 43 for the end of the trading session, opening tomorrow at 44, 45, followed by, by the settlement period boost. Who knows? We can skyrocket to even 40 bucks depends on the consolidation levels of the each of these trading sessions and looking at the current dark pool data my dear apes we're talking about 73 very close to 74 percent dark pool trades at the time of 11 24. again this is not something new usually before noon they have around 70 percent dark pool trades in the afternoon you will see the same exact percentage when we do the follow-up, it will be around 65, 64, 66 percent. In the afternoon, they tend to use less dark pool because we have uh, higher volume. It's like a snowball effect. People uh, look at the price action pre and around noon. In the afternoon, they take positions. So this is why you will see lower percent percentage from the dark pool in comparison with the one that is now before noon. Very, very, very bullish, guys.
the chart looks bullish the numbers are bullish this is something also that we have to talk about uh, even though some of some of the indicators from ortex indicate that lower short interest less shares on loan and we have what cost to borrow it's down but the utilization remains at a higher level utilization has net positive so this is again something very very good hopefully today we can close above 43 dollars guys this is the goal for today let me know in the comment section what do you expect to see this week for the stock subscribe to the channel like this video and come back for more